Hey, Tracy. Hey, y'all. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning, Tracy. Good morning. Hey, Tracy. Hey, Miss Lullaby. How you doing, sweetie? I'm doing all right. How you doing? I'm good. We gonna have a good day today? Yes, ma'am. We gonna have a good day today. All right. Now, you was asking a lot of questions yesterday. Yeah, I was asking a lot of questions yesterday, but you know, I mean, I just want to make sure I take everything in, make sure I write everything down, make sure I know everything, because when it come down to it, I won't have to ask no more questions no more. You know, if, if I don't know something, I'm gonna ask a question now. You know, that's just me. I understand, baby. Okay. Good morning, class. Good it's so good to see up. you guys. I hope you guys had a good night's nice rest. Um... I had a good night's nice rest. Um, I cooked some good old salmon, some rice, some broccoli, the whole nine, y'all. So I'm ready. I'm full. It's time to get to it. Um, I'm so glad to see y'all. Uh, we 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 we, we gonna have we gonna have some fun. They gonna have a little fun. Mm, We're gonna mm, talk mm. a lot, you know. So any question that you have, make sure you ask me. Just don't interrupt, you know. So um, but anyway, we are gonna get started. Hi, Tracy um, Beach. Just... Hey, Keisha. Girl, I meant to call you and tell you they was talking about you yesterday, girl. They was talking about me. Yes, about you being um asking all them questions and just being like, you know, I'm always the top of the up discussion, discussion, baby. Girl, the way they was talking, you would think they was jealous. Girl, I, look, at least I gave them something to talk about. Um, big grits. They was just mad because you was asking questions, trying to figure. Girl, I ain't worried about it. I'm just gonna have me a good day. I ain't gonna talk as much since everybody got an issue with that because I want to know stuff. You know, I bet you any kind of money that everybody ain't right what they're supposed to write down. Well, I know I did. Whatever. So yesterday, I think we left off on Ooh. skincare and wound protection. Um, so we're going to start on braiding scales, resources, when to place a wound care consult, um, skin products. Um, so all the activities would be um, case study in which a nurse and nursing assistant are paired. Um, the nurse uses the braiding scale and both discuss interventions to reduce pressure injuries. Large group um, discussions hey, Ms. on um, the results. Ma'am. Ma'am. Are you through talking? You good, baby. Go ahead. Okay. Um, so I wanted to ask um, if I don't always understand what's happening and I feel as I should be getting it by now. What should I do? Um, your next step should be request a progress meeting with your educator or nurse manager. I'm sure they'll talk to you in private or, okay. you know what I'm saying? Okay. Give you some, I got you. Give some feedback. I got you. That's all I want to know. Okay. Um, the next category is Centers of Excellence Program. Um, primary Stroke Center is your topic. Um, chest Pain Center, Heart Failure Certification, Level 2 Trauma Center. Um, your hey, activities Tracy. will be showing Tracy. a video of Tracy. signs and symptoms of hey, a stroke. Hey, you had a note from yesterday. <laughs> I got it in my phone. Hold on. Right. Yeah, I, I just need the um the activities. Um, we were talking about some categories and topics. You talking something. about um the activities as far as like the the topics we were talking about? Yeah, that's it. That's it. Um, I know one of the dots. She said that demonstration of the language program on the laptop with projection to the entire group. Review of two case studies. One needing a volunteer to find the answer in the online cultural competency book, and one involving group discussion. Showing up, speak up, the Joint Commission's video on pain, small group workshop, um, identifying and identifying a quality group, how to read and interp interpret answers are shared with the large group. And, and what category that was in? Yeah, um, it was about the um, patient experience and satisfaction. Oh, okay. Yeah. And um, what, what the topics were? Um, the topics were um, patients with limited English, profi proficiency, profi 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 um, patient with limited English proficiency, cultural diversity, pain management, patient rights, ethics, the hospital consumer assessment of healthcare providers and systems, performance improvement. Okay, thank you, girl. You're welcome. No, she ain't still talking. Um, Tracy, Tracy, ma'am. Hey, is everything okay? No, I was just I was just helping her out. She didn't um get all the notes from yesterday from the questions that I was asking yesterday. And what happened? She didn't get out. She didn't get all the um the notes. So I was just helping her out. Well, well, thank you, Tracy. You're welcome. Okay, so your next category would be professionalism and accountability. Hey, Tracy, did we you get the other notes from yesterday? Look, I look, look, y'all had an issue with me asking all these questions yesterday, but y'all asking me. Make sure y'all talk to Miss Lullaby to make sure it's okay for me to give y'all these these notes because y'all supposed to be paying attention. We couldn't pay attention because you was asking too many questions. So you saying me talking and asking questions yesterday was you, you couldn't understand and you couldn't listen? No, I couldn't. Oh, okay. So you gonna blame it on me? Nobody else was doing all that talking. Oh, so you can't multitask. That's not what I said. Oh, that's crazy because while y'all was asking questions and I was asking questions, I still got the same notes from yesterday that you don't get, you don't have. Tracy, if you don't want to give me the notes, that's fine. I mean, I, I don't mind giving you the notes. I, I mean, like I said, I give it to you, but don't blame it on me that you didn't get the notes because I was sitting in the same classroom that you were in and I still got those same notes. Tracy, can you just give me the notes, please? Oh, okay. Um, but one of the um categories was skincare and wound prevention. Uh, I was talking about as far as like the topics, it was braiding scale, um, resources. Went to place a wound care consult, um, skin products, 
and the activities were case study in which a nurse and nursing assistant are paired. The nurse uses the Braden scale and both discuss interventions to reduce pressure injuries, large group discussion on the results of case study. Is there any way you can send it to me? Yeah, yeah. I mean, um, just just give me your email. And I can just email you my um the paper that I got. Well, the notes that I took on my uh, on my phone, I can just send it to you. Okay, that's fine. Okay. Okay, let's talk about the nursing process. Okay, so number one, guideline helps nurse implement their roles. Number two, integrates Excuse art me, Tracy. and source Tracy. of nursing. Hey, can Three. you help me? Yes, ma'am. You got the notes for career opportunities. Um, you talking about the career opportunities? Yeah, that's it, yeah. Hey, Miss Lullaby. Yes, ma'am, go ahead. Hey, um, I don't mean to interrupt you or, or the class, um, but um, another one of my classmates asked me about some notes that I took on yesterday because she didn't have them. And I was trying to see if I could read them to her. Um, like I said, I don't want to interrupt your class, but I just want to make sure I give her the note so that way she'll have it. Yes, ma'am. Just don't be loud. Okay. Yes, ma'am. Um, so um, the career opportunities was, it said that graduates upon passing licensure exams are prepared to fulfill registered nursing or licensed practical nursing entry-level positions as staff nurses and may be employed in, in a variety of set settings such as hospitals, clinics, physician offices, um, rehabilitative and long-term care facilities and outpatient clinics. You said outpatient clinics? Yeah, outpatient okay, clinics. Okay, okay, thank you. Yeah. Ooh, I appreciate that. You're welcome. Number four, defines the areas of care that are within the domain of nursing, nurse practice arts. Um, number five, define legal scope of nursing practice. Number six, create state board of nursing to make hey, and Tracy. enforce rules and regulation. Mm -hmm. Do you have the notes on patient safety um, when oh. you're talking about neglect and small groups and stuff like that? You probably had to ask her because I'm not sure... Um, what she said on that but um i did write down um the patient safety and the patient safety and safety um the topics were abuse and neglect okay um safety procedures okay and codes um culture of safety okay um and occurrence reporting uh, okay. as far okay. as like the activities that i put down i think i only got one which was um answers from the small group activity are shared with the large group using teach back techniques okay i think i got the other one. Oh, you got the other one yeah okay, yeah I mean, yeah, yeah I, I, that's that's the only one i got so what what's the what's the one that you got uh it's a small group activity in which sense. learners draw cards with safety codes and use their handbook oh. to find answers that's the one i got handbook to yeah to find answers find answers yeah 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 okay thank you thank you and you're welcome so now we're going to talk about the five vital signs. We got respiration, pulse rate, we got blood pressure, temperature, pain. Excuse me, Tracy, um, can Same you please be quiet? Say, with, be quiet? Um, yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Ma'am, first of all, um, I don't know you and I haven't even really said anything today. And for you to come at me like that is very disrespectful. I just feel like you're talking just a little bit too loud. Well, ma'am, I'm not talking even, I'm not even talking loud. I mean, I, I know I had a bad, bad two days these past two days, but today hasn't been as bad as it usually be. I'm actually giving people the notes that they didn't get, you know, so actually me talking and asking questions actually worked, you know, for my benefit and for others. So I'm actually helping people out and actually helping myself. And for you to come at me like I'm just out here just talking for no reason and just being loud and obnoxious, it's actually disrespectful. I don't mean to be disrespectful. I'm just letting you know Man, that you're please, being loud. Like I said, you don't know me and you can get this clap clap, but please don't play with me because I don't even know you and you don't know me. Okay, what's the problem back there? Ma'am. What's what's wrong? Miss Lullaby, like I said, I, 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 I'm not trying to interrupt your class or nothing like that, but this young lady right here just came at me and she telling me that I'm talking too much, I'm talking too loud, and I hadn't even said anything. All I'm doing is helping these young ladies out that need notes that they didn't yet get yesterday because I don't know. You know, a lot of people said that I was talking a lot yesterday and they couldn't get, you know, they, the, the notes that they needed, but the same notes that they said they didn't get, I got, and other people asking questions, the questions that they was asking, I got those notes, so I don't know if they just can't multitask or whatever the case may be. Um, Like I said, I'm just helping, you know, like helping people out. And for her to come at me like that, it's disrespectful. And if I was to get up and knock her out, then I get put out of class. And I'm sure you don't want that, right? No, ma'am, I don't want that. Okay, cool. But at, at least she can respect me. Well, I apologize, Tracy. I didn't mean uh, anything bad. I was just saying. I accept your apology. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and move on. Um, sorry about the interruption, y'all. Um, um, yes, ma'am. Miss Lullaby, I got yes, one more question, if you don't mind, since we um, kind of. Go ahead, Tracy. Hold on. Go ahead. To... I had the question written down. Hold on. Um. Um, I can't seem to get any of my tasks or medication administration completed on time. Um, is there any way, like, an example you can give me of how, you know, I could help get help on that? You'll probably have just reviewed the medication administration policy and set a time frame for completion. Okay. Um, identify unf unfamiliar medications okay. with your preceptor and review the set time frames to complete tasks. Okay. Then follow up with your preceptor. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. You're welcome.
People, understand, you're going to have a lot of resources to be able to do a lot of things. So just, just make sure you ask questions as much as possible. Tracy, Tracy, come on, baby. Come I'm, on. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I apologize. What, what you, I, I keep forgetting. I'm sorry. <laughs>